have come in today for a few adjustments and a massage. Okay, and can you explain to me what you're looking to receive relief from? Yes, we have quite a few patients who come in for endometriosis pain relief. Um, so explain to me where your pain areas are, please. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. And is this pain persistent for you, or does it come and go? Okay. Alright. And I can see you've tried other forms of pain relief and treatment in the past. Okay, and what were those? Okay. Yep, I'm just cross-confirming. Okay, and what were they? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And have you had any luck with either of those? Okay. So, headaches you said you get? And do you take anything for that when that happens? Does it do anything to help relieve the pain? Sometimes. Okay. And same for your lower back and your knees. Do you take pain relief for that? Okay, not always. Okay, depends on... Yeah, okay. And speaking of it, depending on the variations in pain, are you in any pain right now? Okay, your knees just are aching a little bit. Okay, I can focus on that area for you as well. Um, and that, is that the only area that's really bothering you right now? Okay, all right. So with our hopes coming away from this session, we'd like for you to have a little bit of headache relief. Loosen up the muscles in the lower back and remove tension kind of soothes the knee pain. Now there's no guarantee I can make it go away, but I may do movements that'll help your muscles again relax or loosen up that day-to-day -day walking or um, rubbing around the kneecap yourself can't fix itself. Okay. All right, so this may take multiple sessions to help get you relief um, even more so that you're looking for. Try and move away from taking so much pain medication, which I understand can be, it can feel like a lot. And by pain medication, I do mean over-the-counter ibuprofen or Tylenol, stuff like that. Have you been given anything from your doctor that's a little bit stronger? Okay, nothing addictive though, okay. Perfect, so we will start with your head first. When you get your headaches, where do you feel them? Okay, so at the base of the head here. And sometimes at the temples. Okay. I may mess up your hair a little bit. <laughs> so that's what's gonna happen, but it's a good thing your hair is short. 
So let me move to the other side of the table. I'm going to start by massaging the base of your head. Do the headaches move into your shoulders at all? of your head. This is getting quite warm, as you probably have noticed. Yeah, with the season change, it's getting a bit warmer in here. So the window is cracked. You will hear bird noises and potentially other outdoor noises. Hopefully not too loud. Don't disturb your session here. We also requested the pets in the room, so we do have three dogs. And they are asleep, so hopefully that encourages you to relax. I'm going to move to your temples now. This motion's up your scalp and down your neck. The bed's squeaking so much as well. It happens. <laughs> Top this again. How often do you get your headaches? Okay. At least once a week. All right. Yeah, that's kind of frequent. You need to watch that. your head at the end of the massage. So now I'm just going to feel down your back for any knots in the muscles I may feel or areas of your spine that feel locked to me because even spaces up here can contribute to pain down here if something is off. spots I'm going to have to do quick pressure points on, but nothing crazy. And I am going to have to feel around your gluteus maximus, so pardon me if that is uh, too invasive for you, you can let me know and I will try to avoid the area as much as possible. But because endometriosis has to do with the uterus and you know, all of the organs down there with how it spreads. I need to kind of be around this area to do the adjustments. So if at any moment something is uncomfortable or you are not just not comfortable with it, let me know, okay? Okay. Alright, so your pain is down here, right? Yeah, the muscles are kind of tight. Have you had previous surgeries to do any clear outs of the lesions inside? Okay. All right, yeah, I won't be working on the front today, but if you'd like me to do some um, massage and adjustments around the front, we can do that at some point. 
I'll just be careful of any scars you may have, okay? Yeah, there's some tension here. Let's start with the pressure point tool. And we'll relieve some of these little knots, and then I'll start working on everything down here, and we'll then move down to your legs. Okay, so there was something here along your spine. being too forceful, let me know. Okay? And then there was a spot here. of these around your hips, okay? If at any moment anything is uncomfortable, please tell me and we will adjust or completely stop with this, okay? All right. Deeper with the massage I'm going to do around here. I'm going to work some of the muscles out, and then I do need to do adjustments closer to the hips and the sacral area. Okay. Do the joints at your hips ever bother you? Okay, sometimes, but not always.
done some massage down here. I am going to just do some adjustments. I'm going to start by wiggling your hips. Just doing some little wiggles. Now I need you to take a deep breath in. And let it out. Good. And this is where I'm going to get a little more personal down here, okay? I'm going to put my hand right here. And I need you to take another deep breath in. Okay, and let it out. Okay, on the other side. Alright, same thing. Gotta get a little personal here. Okay, take a deep breath in. And let it out. everything feeling okay I'm going to do some more wiggling now at your hips again this can help as well as pressing into the dimples on your back here that can relieve some pain in the moment and just some muscle tension okay so we're going to do press, 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 press release again Okay, perfect. Again, press, 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 release. If you need to take breaths while I'm doing this, you can, okay? Everything's still comfortable. Okay. And I'm going to grab your hips now and wiggle them from down here. Okay. Good. And we're going to move on to your knees now. And then I'll do a quick overall for the whole body with some tools at the end. Okay. Scratching an itch you can't reach. <laughs> yeah. Okay, just a few more knee wiggles. Side. And on this side. Mm-hmm. 
start doing the massage that's going to finish up the session, okay? So, just relax. If you fall asleep, completely fine. Um, but, again, if anything is bothering you, but again, if anything is ever bothering you, please tell me and I will adjust. Okay, give me one second. So, I'm going to apply some of this Dr. Teal's Moisturizing Body Oil. It's lavender scented, is that okay? Okay, it's made with jojoba oil, sweet almond oil, and aloe vera. Is everything listed there? Okay. Great. I just like to make sure. So I'll put some of this on. shoulders. Slight wiggles to your head, okay? Okay, good. And again. And then relax. Down your arms. I didn't mention any arm pain, so do you have any arm pain at all?
muscles on your back. Try to focus on the areas we worked on today. So I'm going to use this around the base of my neck. Do you like gua sha over your body?
completely fine staying here and resting, taking a nap even if you'd like. Take your time getting up. Um, everything I touched on today were the areas you mentioned, but if next time you'd like me to focus somewhere else, please let me know. Sometimes tension from one area could cause pain in another, so we can always hop around and focus on that. But for next session, if you'd like me to do something with the front side, we can do that as well, more of a tummy massage. I know having the surgeries can create scar tissue, so if we can break some of that up so it doesn't build up too much, then that is an option as well. Uh, we can even focus on the top of the knee and your shoulders as well as your head again. So whatever you are fine with or whatever you'd like me to touch on, we can totally do. So I worked on your head. to your knees today because you did tell me that they were bothering you so we only did some movements and massage with those but we can always do adjustments the next time if and when they're not bothering you as much okay focus on the front and lower stomach area. And is there anything else I can do for you today? No. Okay, perfect. Perfect. Well, I hope you are relaxed and that some relief can come to you. And if you'd like to schedule future assessments, adjustments, massages, then please see the front desk, okay? And I will include a packet that they can hand you on your way out with any information you may need, even at home massages and remedies you can do if you're having pain and looking for relief, okay? All right, well, thank you so much for coming in, and I will see you in the future, okay? All right.